Dean, your initial thoughts after that? Uh, towards the points that we targeted. Um, 90% of the game plan worked, we wanted to get come in and get a clean sheet and then we just didn't have enough cut throat in the, in the opposition's box to, uh, to to win the game basically so um, yeah, another point and then uh, move on to the next It's all about taking our chances, is that just because we're missing those key players still? Yeah, press up, press. You know, the top teams can't be without the top players I'm afraid and uh, I'm talking about Premier League teams and Champions League teams we're without our big players. Uh, the schedule sort of caught up for us, but um, it's not been the worst weekend for us. We're still six points in the playoffs with four games to go. Um, obviously, ideally, we want to get a home toy, and it's coming to that crunch stage now where um, every point, everything matters. So, um, ideally, I don't think we played great, um, and we just didn't have enough penetration to our game, to be honest with you. Um, but we defended well at times, and um, I've had to make subs now regularly at half time, which is very really frustrating. That tells them players where they're at. Mentioned about uh, players missing out. Joey McKeem, I think that's the first game he's missed this season. Is that just to give him some rest or is there an injury? No, he's got a hamstring issue. Um, he's got a tight hamstring. Um, so, yeah, we just can't take a risk. He's too important to us. And again, you mentioned the half time change. Don Revan, was that just down to fitness or tactical? He was booked again. Um, um, I didn't think he was defending well enough. It looked like they were going to get in on his side. I think the left hand side in the first half, uh, sort of there, left, there, right. Just didn't think he defended well enough. So, big learning for Dom this, this year. He's got to step up to the plate and perform. I think I've took him off half time in the last two or three games. So, that's the business, it's rootless. He's got to perform. Uh, he's been given his opportunity. So, um, has he taken it? Probably not. Uh, Courtney Senior seemed to be pulled down in the box towards the end of the game. Did you see much of that and did you think that was a penalty? Yeah, the court is a clear penalty, but look, you can't rely on referees. I didn't think the referee was particularly great today, personally. Very quick to flash cards and stuff like that, so on a, on a wet, windy day. But um, even at the end, one of their players tackled their own player and he gave a foul for them, you know, against us. So, look, we can't rely on referees. Um, we've got to be more clinical with a great chance at the end. Moyle's got a great golden opportunity. Win should have scored. They had a great chance in the second half, to be fair, from a, from a, from a set piece. But they should have scored themselves. But, you know, we've had enough chances to win the game today. We've not been clinical enough. And next is we welcome Wrexham to the Hive. How's the ne- this week going to look for the squad? Yeah. We're going to be in our week. Um, we'll have plenty of time to rest in the summer. Um, I was going to give the lads a couple of days off, but that's not going to happen now. Um, so we're in. Um, we can't rest on our laurels. I think we've got plus left, two weeks left, two and a bit weeks left. So, um, yeah, four massive pushes. Uh, on to the next. Dean, thank you for your time. Cheers.